What's up, my friends? Hey, check this out. You're looking forward towards the new RJ Ally X, right? Or you're still rocking the original RJ Ally, and you're still looking for the Ally power bank that's going to charge your RJ Ally and let you play a 30 watts turbo mode. Look no further. I think I got the ID power bank for you right here. This one I've been rocking it for a couple of weeks, and it's been a pleasure to have while I'm gaming. This thing is a great power bank. I kid you not. This power bank is made from a company called CBQ. And one thing I like about it is the design. It got a nice candy bar design, which I like very much. And the size of this, 20,000 milliampere power bank. So you're gonna, go after, you're gonna have a whole lot of juice to play your favorite games. And you got a button right here with four indicators, and it tells you the percentage of your power bank. Pretty cool stuff, right? 65 watt power delivery, charge your RG Ally, and your future RG Ally X as soon as you get it. And you can play at 30 watt turbo mode. It's cool stuff. Not only that, this power bank is not heavy. It's really not. I'm going to show you on the scale right here. You know, some power banks is very heavy. So when you take it with you to play your games or whatnot, the weight can be a little bit bothersome. But check this out. This thing weighs only 408 grams. This is less than a pound. You can't go wrong. Less than a pound. But check this out. Another thing, a lot of times people playing their game, they enjoy the power bank, they enjoy what they got with it, but you walking around with a power bank in your hand or hold it up or put it in a pocket, it's kind of it's kind of uneasy, right? But one thing I like about this product right here by CBQ, it comes with a bracket. Yeah, it comes with a bracket that you can put on the back of the ROG Ally. So you may think to yourself, okay, cool. I got a bracket I can put at the back of my RG Ally and use at a kickstand. But that still does not solve my problem. My, my power bank is going to be hanging all over the place and it's going to be uncomfortable holding it in my hand or putting it in my case while I game. Aha! It's not only just a bracket. If you look carefully right here, you see this piece right here? This piece right here is to hold on to the power bank. What? Yeah. This power bank right here, right here on this power bank is magnet. Yes, it's magnet. So not only that, you can connect your power bank to the RG Ally, you connect to the bracket, boom. And you take it with you on game. Yes, magnet is pretty strong, but it but it's only as strong to a certain limit. So you're not gonna be the one to be running around and shaking it and not, and not expect it to fall. It will fall if you give it maximum shakeage, but I'm giving it some decent shaking and the magnet still holding on. Pretty good stuff, it got great grip, good stuff. And it's very easy to put on the RG Ally. All you gotta do, just slide it on back to the back of your RG Ally, like this. It's very simple. Boom, connect it. And you're done. That's a kickstand right there, right? Cool. So all you gotta do next is very simple. Just connect your, this is my favorite cable right here, the 90 degree cable that comes with it. Great stuff. Not much company offer options with cables in their products where they sell. So what I usually do, I just, kick, I just connect my USB Type-C right here, the 90 degree one, connect it to the power bank like this. I keep on sliding it over. Now, boom. See, I got it connected. So imagine this. You're at your friend's house or you're somewhere just chilling, right? Oops. You're just somewhere chilling and you're there playing a game. You're just playing a game with your friends you connect it to the TV, or you just kick it back at the mall or the park, you just play the game. You there enjoying the game with the power bank connected to your RG Ally. You don't need no special straps, you don't need no special hook. Just connect it to the bracket, and it's all magnet, and it holds pretty well. So, with extra weight, it's gonna shake off, but you, decent shaking, it won't fall. Maximum shaking, it's gonna fall. But let me show you something real quick. Remember, I tell you, you can. Oops, I, I knocked it off. Remember, I tell you, you can play at 30 watts. I'm going to show you right here. Look carefully. And now I'm going to connect it back. And I'm going to connect the cord onto the power bank. You see power delivery, turbo mode. Let me go into armor recreate. Look right here. It says what? 30 watt turbo mode. So right now you're gaming at 30 watt and it's charging at the same time. That is pretty decent. So I'm gonna disconnect it again. Whatever you had the RG Ally on previously, yes, it's gonna go back to default. 
But you want the game, some of the games that you play demands more to get the best performance. And, and that's 30 watts. Connect it. Boom. Takes a little couple of seconds. Power delivery turbo. You back to 30 watts. Gaming right off the jump. And it charge. And some people may say, well, yes, a power bank, it doesn't charge fast enough. Realistically, if you're gaming anywhere between 25 and 30 watts, of course it's going to take some time. There's some power bank I'm going to show you real quick. This is one of my favorite power banks, but I don't use it much. You'll be gaming at 30 watts. You'll be gaming at 30 watts. And sometimes you see where it's charging. But, but um, you may show you that it's charging right here, as you can see. But the percentage does not move. This one, when I game, it actually went up. And think about it, it's 20 watt, 20,000 million amperes. You're going to game for maybe two hours or so. You're going to have good gaming while it charges your battery. So in realistically, gaming at 30 watts and it charge, that's amazing. There's several power banks out there that promise you that it will charge while you game. And it doesn't. This one does it. And like I said, it's cool. You don't have to, you don't have to worry about to hold it up in your hands and um, do all sort of stuff. You put it in your bag or whatnot. Simply just connect it, boom, you're good to go. All magnetic, simple stuff. This is the ideal power bank, and trust me, like I said, I've been using it for a couple of weeks, and I love it. The CVQ power bank for the RG Ally. Or if, you look, if you're going to get the RG Ally X, still can, you still can use it. Great stuff. All right, that's your boy right here. Thanks for tuning in, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and look forward to my next video. We're going to show you the latest and the best docking station you can buy for your RG Ally, the Vanky Gaming Dock. Look forward to this video, but you got to subscribe and hit the notification bell. So when I drop this video, you'll be the first to know. Thanks for tuning in.